Welcome back everyone. We are at the Contemporary today where we will be doing brunch dining at Steakhouse 71. It's a first for both of us. Courtney is excited because it's breakfast food. So let's go. We're gonna bring you along for our experience and I've never done this before so we're about to have some fun. Let's go. So this is the American with scrambled eggs. I got scrambled eggs, I put some salt and pepper on them. The potatoes, they didn't say it came with a little biscuit, but it comes with a biscuit and quite a few pieces of bacon. They brought us some grape jelly and these little cute thingies. And then ketchup for the weird people that like ketchup on eggs. Butter for your biscuit if you need it. Courtney got potatoes and the ham and cheddar omelet with the biscuit. And I would say she's pretty excited to try our food. So we're gonna eat and let you know how it is once we're done. Alright, so breakfast was very good. We'll give you more of a review in a minute when we're done. When I finish my plate, Courtney's almost done over there. But these little grape jellies were very good. I'm gonna take the last two with me because I want to, but I would say in all in all, this was a very, very good breakfast. Alright everyone, we just finished our breakfast at Steakhouse 71. And it was probably it was actually it was very good. What did you think? I really liked it. Yeah, so Courtney got the ham and cheddar omelet, which looked very good. They also brought her a cupcake because it's almost her birthday. By the time you guys see this, it'll only be a couple of days till her birthday, but we ate that. We ate part of that, a lot of sugar, so we, and it's early in the morning still. But otherwise, that is the breakfast I recommend, brunch, breakfast brunch that I recommend y'all doing. And now we're going to head over to Epcot. Don't know if, um, what rides we're gonna ride because you know it's holiday weekend still and guardians was down last time i checked so that means all the other rides have extremely long waits but we're gonna head over there and see what happens and then possibly go over to the magic kingdom later but let's go Cross, 30 minutes, Grand Fiesta Tour is 35, Journey to Figments 40, 
on at Olsa's 40. Living Land's 45, you know, that's busy there. Spaceship Earth has an hour wait. That's crazy. Mission Space is 80 minutes. Frozen's 120. Soren's 120. Test Track's 120. And Remy's 150. So I should tell you, it's a very busy day here at Epcot. So we're just gonna start out into the countries and walk and see what speaks to us today because none of those wait times sound like fun waiting. So far, all the food booths are closed from Festival of the Holidays. They still have all the decorations up though, minus the big tree. But Epcot seems to actually be in between festivals, even though they, the sign is would say they're not in between festivals. But so far, we haven't found anything. That there's like no character meet and greet stuff, even right. So we're just walking around the country, just debating if we want to go to Magic Kingdom or Hollywood Studios. But we're gonna, I think we're gonna finish the loop here, and then we'll decide because you know what else we got to do on a nice, beautiful, hot January day in the state of Florida. So we're headed towards France now. And I believe Remy was like 185. But we'll see what it is when we get over there, see if it had just gone down or something like that. And the time went down. But we're just walking. So no food yet that we found to try, at least. So is there anything you want to say? She says it's hot. Alrighty, Courtney, who are you going to meet? Who are you going to meet? Eeyore. We're off to meet Eeyore. We found someone to meet at, out here at Disney. We found a character to meet. Are you, are you ready? Are you sure you're ready? No. Okay, so, okay, so, we met Eeyore, then we're staying in lines, we're meeting Eeyore. Mickey walked out, so we walked over and met Mickey also. And he's in his, like, fancy getup. Not his, like, 50th or his traditional getup. Like, I don't know what you call it, but Mickey looked better than I did dressed, so, you know. And then he also freaked out about Courtney solely. That's in the back of her backpack. So, but we're headed back. We're headed over to Magic Kingdom now because there's not much to do here. And they have shorter wait times over there right now. So that's where we're headed to finish up our day. So I'll see you when we get over to Magic Kingdom. All right, guys. So we made it over to the Magic Kingdom and the railroad is in the station and it is running. So first things first, we have to go ride the railroad because Courtney's never ridden it before. So we're going to ride the railroad now because it's that time. horses until we come to a complete stop. So what'd you get? Um, the beef nachos. We got the beef nachos, red right, peco bills. They gave us salsa. 
We got some hot sauce. By the way, we've ridden the train all the way around and back to Frontierland again from Main Street, so let us tell you to go on the nachos. I got chicken nachos. And if you like sour cream, they give you a lot of sour cream. So this is gonna be our lunch slash dinner because as you see, it's 4.11. But we're gonna go ahead and eat and then do some more fun stuff at Magic Kingdom, right? Alrighty, so we got the cheeseburger spring roll. I've never tried this before. So I'm gonna open this up. Oh, there's two of them in there. So Courtney, you'll get one. Whatever the sauce is, don't know what the sauce is. I like tartar sauce. What does it smell like to you? I don't know what this. I don't know what that is. Yeah, read it. I don't know what that sauce is. I'm a little <laughs> skeptical. Okay. Cheeseburger. Spring roll. I'm not gonna lie. I kind of feel like I'm eating a McDonald's cheeseburger with the amount of onion in this. The amount of onion, if you know, if you eat McDonald's cheeseburgers, you know how much onion they put on those things. So, yeah, Courtney's working the camera, so she's trying to work the camera, like, she's taking photos, but it's a video. Alrighty, her turn. Alrighty. What do you think? You don't taste the onion? We well, I got a big chunk of it. She's so gonna hate me when I put that in the video. You don't taste the onion? Alright, lay on. Let's see if I'm going crazy, guys. I use the onion to season the meat. So depending how much meat you get, or where you are in the meat and it came out of the pan, is where you get the onion, because I taste the onion again, so. But overall, y'all are right, these do taste good, so. So if anybody was wondering how the crowds are during New Year's, this is how they are. walking back to the contemporary to go get the truck um, we are wrapping it up here at Magic Kingdom and our day at Disney so make sure you like and subscribe and follow us on Instagram and on TikTok and we'll see you soon bye <laughs>